Welcome back everyone, I am the Executioner and let's get right into this. So Kyle Rittenhouse allegedly failed the ASVAB test. What is the ASVAB test? So it's a test for every military service branch which basically tries to tell if you're retarded or not. Sorry if I used the politically incorrect word, but that's what it's meant for. Allegedly, Kyle Rittenhouse failed it so badly that he can never join the Marine Corps. Apparently, he is permanently banned from ever enlisting ever again. First of all, the ASVAB test can be taken multiple times, so I don't really know why they're promoting this claim. But second of all, the claim is from a screenshotted image, allegedly from the Kenosha Police Department, and it's been circulated all over the news recently from the Huffington Post to all sorts of other media outlets, and it's being spoken as if it is gospel. Well, apparently, people are still looking into it, so I can't say if it's definitive or not. He failed the ASVAB test so badly that he can never try to enlist again, but I can definitely say that he could definitely take the ASVAB test again. There really is nothing preventing him from taking the ASVAB test again. Unless he has, like, a mental disorder that would prohibit him from joining the Marine Corps or any other military branch, he could probably take it no problem. What's very funny about this is that it's actually a selling point by the Marine Corps in the U.S. Army that you can take the ASVAB test again. There are people who fail it the first time. There are people who fail it the second time. That is totally normal. Now, we're gonna have to wait if there's actually an official image or press release from the Marine Corps stating that Kyle Rittenhouse failed so badly that he can never join. But from what we have right now, it's just a screenshot from an alleged Kenosha Police Department memo. And there really isn't a link to where the memo is or where the email is. So I think people need a lot more skepticism towards this. And if it turns out true that Kyle Rittenhouse failed that test, okay, you can have that punch. But... For people just to come out swinging saying that it is absolutely true no matter what, that is kind of stupid. And I think people should have a lot more brains to think, oh, maybe we should verify this Kenosha Police Department memo or screenshot. For fuck's sakes, like I looked up a fact checking article and even they said, well, we can't confirm if it's true or not, we're still researching it, but if you look at it, there's really nothing preventing him from trying to take it again. You can take the ASVAB test a lot of times, and yes, there is a cool-off period between taking tests, but that does not mean that Kyle Rittenhouse failed so badly that he can never join the Marine Corps. There's no evidence to say that he did so badly besides a screen shotted image and a bunch of articles people have been sharing around and trying to say that's evidence when that evidence is based on a screenshot that may or may not be real. So what in the hell are we doing here? The fact is a lot of this is political. People don't like that Kyle Rittenhouse was found innocent. They're gonna latch on to anything they can find to make him look bad. And that's just the matter of what this is. It's politicization against Kyle Kyle Rittenhouse. And that will always be the case for how long Kyle Rittenhouse lives. He will always carry on that burden for the rest of his life, even though he was found innocent by a jury of his peers, and the video evidence shows he acted in self-defense. But people are always going to politicize that and try to fit it for their agenda. Anyways, guys, I hope you liked the video. Please share it and subscribe, and have a wonderful solar eclipse. Hope you guys have a good one and goodbye.